Hello, Mega Dementors here, back for another sequel healing video. Last time we killed Sachin, Sachin, I don't know. And now we're going to start chapter 4. Chapter 4, Dark Scar, part 1. That this is a pretty new chapter. So this is like, this will be probably after. So if we can relate to the other routes, this will be probably after when you kill like Nero and stuff. And those two first routes. It's a bit, but those the sense sequence is a bit shorter than that time. But that means that means the other sequences are gonna be a bit longer. I don't know. I don't know which one is the longest route. I don't remember. I don't know. I think CL has like very very short. I don't know. I I awaken to br to brilliant sunshine. Hmm. I climb out of bed and look out of the window. The weather out of the window is beautiful. Truly fitting for a Sunday. Eh, the sun uh, actually is not Sunday anymore. <laughs> it's 12. <laughs> no. <laughs> that is, there isn't a cloud in the sky as if it's trying to tell me everything that happened yesterday was just a dream. It's in morning. My chest hurts. My chest hurts. The unmatched clear sky greets me as if it always, do always does. As it always does. I don't know, I think that's weird, weird, I guess. But the fact... But that fact just hurts me too much. And I keep saying that. Let's move the mic there, right because I this is glowing <laughs> right in my face. I don't want to see that. <laughs> but that fact just hurts me too much. That girl. That girl who disappeared last night. Who will never be able to experience a morning like this again. Shiki-sama, are you awake? <clears throat> yeah. yeah, I haven't done the voice in such a long time, <laughs> so it sounds similar, I think. That voice brings me back to reality. What is it all of a sudden? Being regretful is that hypocrisy. Shiki-sama, are you awake, Shiki-sama? Knock, knock. Com comes a hesitant sound at the door. I'm back in my room. No matter how much I reg how much regret I feel, I wake up like always, and he's ignoring Hisui's chan. You don't, you do not ignore Hisui. Ah, she's one. Well, do this route. You will not mirror. I think like this route. As long as I live, I can't escape reality. No matter how much I regret it. Yeah, I'm up. Yeah, I'm up. Come in. Please excuse me. The door opens with a clink, and Hisui enters. Good morning, Shigi-sama. Did she come to ch get my change of clothes? She's carrying a clean set. Morning, Hisui. Um, has everyone had breakfast already? Shigi-sama, forgive me for my rudeness, but did you check the time? The time since you woke up. Eh. The time. Is it still morning? The clock claim. The clock claims. The clock claims it's past twelve. Yeah. <laughs> what is the clock? It's noon already. I think the. I think the clock is not not the one. <sighs> okay, I think the clock is not the one who has the time incorrect. I think the clock is not the one. With the time incorrect. Shigisama. Uh, I came to wake you, you many times this morning, but you did not open your eyes even once. Uh, was it really that? Was it really that deep of sleep? <laughs> Just my mind, but my body suffered heavy wounds. I suppose. I see. I'm sorry. You didn't wake me up. Just what, what was I doing? Uh, it was late at night, but I still shouldn't have slept le in like that. Well, that, that didn't stop you before in, in school days, so why now? Uh, that was, it was like weird. So I do understand sometimes it happens. So I was like, eh, different different time like, you know. No, you do not have school today, so sleeping in was an option. But Shigisama, you intend to go out again tonight? Eh, no, not at all. Uh, more importantly, 
I'm wondering how Aiga is. I think she was up late last night too. Aiga, Aiga, Sam woke up at her usual time this morning. He sweet looks as she wants to say something more, but she answers my question. Oh. <laughs> she really is different from me, leading that different lifestyle. I think back to what happened last night. While I was still in days, subbed her over what happened with Yumizaka, Aiga took care of me while even asking any questions. Okay, that, um, it's a little embarrassing, so I don't want to remember it. Hey, sweet, is Aiga still here? She's an awfully busy person. She's not a busy person, so does she have a routine or a day off? Yes, she does plans during the day off, but then she's still in the mansion. She has plans, but she's still here. I don't quite get it, but well, I'll get changed, so please, some please head to the same ahead of me. Yes, oh, please excuse me. As usual, this week glides away with, without a sound. Uh, he's we. Yes. What is it, Shiki-sama? Yeah, I forgot to say something. Thanks for coming to wake me up. It's a little late, but good morning, Hisui. Oh, that is so adorable. That, that deep red blush of Hisui. Yes. Please have a nice day, Shiki-sama. Staring out of the ceiling, I had a deep breath. Uh, Umazaka Sasuki, and he didn't mention he's really used to blushing. What do I know? That I don't know. That's something I can never forget for the rest of my life. But I will not let it control my life. I have a home to return to. I got here for me, and I have an ordinary life to live. To protect all of that, I betrayed her. So if I can protect that, then everything will have been a lie. Is that just shrugging coolness? Maybe. Maybe all I can do is deceive myself. Well, he's always waiting. I should change quickly and go back to the normal light waiting for me in the city room. It's been a while since I do with Kohaku's voice, if I remember correctly. In the same room, Ag is on sofa. Kohaku san is keeping her company, and Hisui is standing by the wall. Good morning, Shigi san. Okay, they're perfectly. Okay, good. Morning, Kohaku san. Sorry, Barba, can you fix me something to eat? I'm a little hungry from all that sleeping. Yes, right away. I'll get ready, so please wait a little bit. Kohaku san quickly pads away towards the dining room. Then I and then Lee's I and Hisui, who is standing worthy like a statue. <laughs> yo, I <laughs> you you do not say yo to go a proper lady. Uh, yeah, that's probably something that she said. Yo, I good good morning. I uh, she looks at me with this as I look at her face and doesn't return my greeting. Uh I knew she'll be upset from last night. I know the story since I, I embraced her like that last night. I don't know, that looked more like a blush than disgust. Like, uh, last night was. Nissan, sleeping in this late. Just what were you thinking? Nissan, sleeping in this late. Just what were you thinking? Uh, well, um, um, um well, I, uh, sorry? Jeez, I'm not mad about that. It's your day off. It's your day off, and you're chosen to sleep in until now. It's your laziness that ang- it's your laziness that angers me. Well, hm, I got angrily turns her face away. Well, maybe my imagination, but previously is a better word than angry. 
was at Italy. Well, I couldn't help it. I got laid out last night. My body was just tired. You brought that on your. You brought that on yourself. No matter what the circumstances, please obey the rules of the house. I. I hate to admit it, but since she went to sleep the same time, I did not. I did. I did. I did. I did, and so woke up early. I really can't account counter her argument. Besides, Nissan, she lays we wake you up in the morning. I'll let you go today because of last time, but you be always lazy around. If I do wrong, Nissan. Um, I got. The reason I might play the same, but it's not like I'm seeing in because I want to. What? So how come you always sleep in until last, the last minute every morning? You don't know how I feel when I wait for you until the last minute and... I guess summer. Uh. Where did the dire throwing atmosphere go? All of a sudden, I got descends into silence. Hey, Aika. I said so before, but waking up past 7 o'clock in the morning isn't intentional. Even I would like to get up early, but my body doesn't seem to listen when I tell it. You want to wake up early? He's probably me a powerful alarm clock. Sure, that'll get me up. Um, Nissan, that means to be question, but do you ever tell Isu the, the time you want to wake, to wake you up? Uh, that's right. I forgot a simple thing as that. Oh yeah, he he, so he comes every morning to wake me up, so it's a right word to do that. So he so, could you please wake me up oh, at six thirty every morning? <laughs> that really help me out. I swing around the face to Hisui. She stares right back at me. <laughs> 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 oh, I love this so much. I refuse. <laughs> forgive, forgive me, but I refuse to wake you up, Shiki Sama. Well, um, I don't know what to say. The shark put my brain on hold. Looking at Sir Ike is also guessing his inner surprise. What? Isui, why can't you wake Nissan? I'm unable to undertake things I cannot do. I do not... I do not think I'm able to put cheeky some of my own power. Unable? Why not? I don't think I don't think I entered our conversation. Unable? Why not? I don't think I entered our conversation. You're going to stare at me. These past three days, all my efforts were fruitless. Shiki sama do you remember how many times I called your name this morning? No, I don't remember. I woke up from your voice. I thought I woke up by myself. That means there is no memory of me, me, of me calling out. I guess, Sama, that is the situation. Oh, I see. I guess says and looks over at me tensely. How do I say this? It seems, it seems my standing here has just been lowered quite a bit. <laughs> In short, you try repeatedly to wake Nissan, but there isn't even a slight reaction on his part. That's how it is. He's, it, it is. He's we. He's we not silently. I not silently as well. <laughs> I see. The truth is, he's we has already been trying to wake me up. Early in the morning, I don't want to say it myself, but I, but I must be really good at sleeping in. Nissan, why are you looking so proud of yourself? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, that is like so funny. Oh, Nissan, why are you looking so proud of yourself? Nothing. I was just surprised, but how daunting it is to wake me to wake to wake me. Hmm. I understand. Is he just like before? Please try and wake Nisa as much as you can. Is he nods and assent. It seems like the conversation is finished. And and, and may, 
Me, just me, waking up whatever I, I feel like again. Hey, by the hey, by the way, he's we. Yes, yes, what is it? Um, does Nissan really not wake up? Even you call his name, he doesn't respond. Yes. She is on sleep is very quiet and he seems like a statue. Like a statue? What? Oh Nisa that, that's a great sleeping posture, huh? No, that's not it. How do I say um she gives him like a completely different person when he sleeps? I never seen such such a peaceful sleeping face, so when I first saw him, I thought he he had passed away I so it's not quite that he's, he's hard to awaken, but it seems very rude to do so. So I can help but be very gentle. When Shiki summons about to wake by himself, it warms warmth returns to his white face, and I know he will wake up soon, but Looking down he sees <laughs> talks about how I, I look when I sleep. I can't help but feel embarrassed. Hey, I would. But there's a girl talking about you, so you shouldn't be embarrassed. That much? Couldn't think of it. A seeing person is completely defenseless, and after listening to that explanation, I flush as red, as if she said she saw me naked. Well, well, her route is next, if I remember correctly, so... You probably will, she will probably will see you naked. He sweet descends into silence, and I goes off to you trying to not look in my direction. Air has become a little heavy. Thanks for waiting. Shiki san, breakfast is ready. A bright voice says, says the situation. <laughs> Thanks. Well, I'll eat up. Yes, please take your time eating. Turn my back to Kohaku san, smile, head to the dining room alone. After I eat lunch, I and Hisu are still in the sitting room. It, it wouldn't be good to ignore them, ignore them and go back to my room, so I sit on the sofa across Aika. Here, Shigi-san. You prefer green tea, right? Kohaku san places af an, an after meal cup of tea on the table beside me. Yeah, thanks. If you don't mind then. No, not at all. This is your home, so please relax a little more. Uh, Hagasan must be, must be trying to make me feel more comfortable here because she takes good care of me. Jeez, I don't think I'm already used to this place. Does it look a little strained? Yes, just a bit. Your shoulders seem a little tense. I wouldn't say you look like back then. But you sure can relax a bit more. <laughs> Kohaku, you shouldn't spoil Nissan. Nissan, Nissan. He's been living like a slough at the Arma's house so long. It's trying good for him to be a little tense just at first. <laughs> yeah, I can't do a girl's laugh. Aika-sama, Aika-sama, you really are sh strict with Shiki-san, are you not? I do not want to be strict, it's just that he's always so spaced out. <laughs> I I have to watch out for him. Space, huh? <laughs> I'm a little surprised. When Aika talks to Hakuhaku-san, there isn't any hint of her usual coldness. Maybe it's because they're so close in age, but they seem really good friends. I glance over at Hisui. This. Okay, I was like reading it because I want to read it just in case I. Had to. Okay, since I got this all the time for Hisui and Kohaku, I think Hisui must be trusted by Aika as well. Isn't Kohaku son and her complete opposite in her personality? I have a feeling that there isn't much to talk between Hisui and Aika. May I be in may I be in service, Shiki Sama? He's <laughs> really realized I was looking at her and asked me if there was anything she can do. No, it was nothing. Uh, uh 
Yeah, you, you, you can ask her to suck her dick. <laughs> I don't know. If, I don't fucking know if I'd ask her. Because uh, I don't. I forget how, how she is. It's been a while since I played this game, so. I don't know. I was just thinking that you really are a calm. Yes. It's something that. It's something that Mikasa. Mikasa's Sama taught me. She answered very directly. Distinctly. The answer is so distinct, I can't continue the conversation. I can't uncarpool and then go silent. You and Kohaku-san are, are still talking. Shiki-san, is okay if I ask a question? Eh, yeah. What is it? It seems like you departed the mansion last night again. So I would like to inquire you has, has had some unusual schedule routine to take care of every night. Uh, no. I don't have anything like that. The past two days were just something special. I still glass that Aiga face when I say this. Aiga is just quietly watching the two of us. I'm pretty not sure how he's we were talking know about my run-in with Aiga last night. I'm sorry, Hisui. I won't go out, out late, uh, late night anymore. So I'm not kidding anymore, so it's not like there's any danger out at night. <laughs> oh well. Uh, I'll be back. <laughs> All right, I'm back. Okay. I was one. I don't know. I think I went to sleep and stuff. So I got tired. <laughs> I didn't want to play. Also, because I didn't want to play more. <laughs> now I kind of do. <laughs> okay. Okay. I already read this. Now I can, okay. It's already right, history. I won't go on that more because I'm not kidding more. I think I read that already. Yeah. So it's not like there's any danger going out at night about that. You you say that, but Shiki-sama, you are the eldest son of the Tona family. Please refrain from doing anything careless. Yes, just as he sweet says. Mm -mm. I think our voice I freaking change again. <laughs> I need to find a consistent voice for her. Yes. <clears throat> okay, he's doing that breathing, so let me see how I can do Yes, just as he sweet Chan says, your personal physician told me that you should not strain yourself. Besides, you you have amenia. That's true. But, but that has nothing to do going on late at night. <laughs> I can't walk by myself. I should... I shouldn't be going to school either, right? Well, yes. But during the day, it's, br it's, it's bright outside and people could help you, right? Uh, and that is different. There has been all these vampire murders recently. So if you go outside and collapse, what will you think will happen? Okay. <laughs> ah. Without thinking my body is short shoulders. Killer vampire. The killer indiscreet clean people on the streets at night. Not saying the class when I kill my own hand. Uh, he just wants to say something incredibly ridiculous because I don't think he's realized an interesting thing. Oh uh, Sachin Sachin, I don't know. Sachin became a vampire. And the murders were happening before she became a vampire, so he doesn't, he hasn't realized it. <laughs> and I just know I have to say this embarrassing line. Uh, maybe I'll skip it next time. I don't know. No, it's okay, Kohaku san. There isn't a, vamp a vampire out there anymore. It's incredibly stupid. <laughs> he's not stupid as Shiro, but he's not the most brightest person. Overload with that. I don't know what the hell that, what that error was. <laughs> I don't know, he's not the brightest person, so it's kind of, it was always a bit weird. Those incidents, they won't happen ever again. <laughs> and it does happen again. Of course, we won't see Roa. Because, 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 we're not, I don't think we'll see Roa because we have not met our equate. She's probably not going to be in this route. And CL, she is, probably, she's going to appear. Because we saw her in school and stuff. So, She's gonna probably have some role, but I forget what role Seal has again. Because Yumazaki Sazuki is no longer in this world. 
I, I keep calling her Sachin because my, my, because because of that meme is like, isn't it sad Sachin? Because she has no freaking route. <laughs> yeah, she will in the future, I guess. I don't know whether though it's gonna be different. I would like the raw image of her original route script, like original script of her original route, like just to play it. But that'd be fun, just. Maybe new animations and stuff like I would like a real, a real pure reboot, remake, not remake like um like remastered, not remake like just a remastered one. I don't know. Uh, uh, that just seems like very it'll be like very fun to play, like e even the sexual things, the scenes. It's cringy. It's incredibly cringy. But I uh, yeah, but the new art yeah, it'll look nice. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Oh? Oh? Is that true, Aegasama? <clears throat> I haven't heard I haven't heard anything about it. The the one to ask is Nice Nissan since he seems to know something about it. Oh yeah, there was a victim from your high school Nissan. Year two, class three, is your class, right? There wasn't a victim for my class. Ash, she's on. You didn't see the news this morning. Last night they found a large quantity of blood for someone named Yumizaka Suzuki in the alley off the main street. The blood seems to have been there for a while, but from the amount of blood there, they say. She is more than likely dead. I I, I think it's Aika's voice. I think it's Aika's voice, but a bit cheery. My heart starts to throb violently. That is supposed to be his voice, but very cheery. I don't know. I'll try. I'll try to fix it. <laughs> the fact that Yumazaki Suzuki is, is dead, I know the better better than anyone else. But when they say she's dead, it sounds like, like, you killed her, didn't you? To me. Nissan, what's wrong? You're really, you're really pale. I can't say I'm alright. Her death. I'm sad that her death was so publicized in reality and could not stay as something just in my heart. I said that I won't regret it, but... A shell envelops me as soon as I think about her. And then? Everyone, everyone. Shigi-sama, every- Yeah, okay, okay, now I got it, okay. Everyone, let's have a welcome party tonight. Okay, there, that, that, that's that's Kwaku's voice. Uhaku-san suddenly makes a loud, loud state announcement. Huh? I can- I get and I say the same thing out loud. Even his way tilts her head. Okay, that blush is so cute. <laughs> a welcome party for Shiki-san. Everyone is here, and we haven't even celebrated Shiki-san's ar arrival yet. So this is new. This this will replace, I think, the scenes. Some scenes that you're trying to look for Arquade, and when you're alone, when you have that those succubus dreams. So tonight should be Shiki san's welcome party. Right? Gohaku san looks at me and smiles. Crap. I must have looked really depressed. Aika sama, is that acceptable? If you allow it, we can start the preparations right away. Yes, Nei-san has finally come back. And we haven't even done anything. I think it's a good idea. But Hisui, you agree, right? Ah, uh, yes. If it's acceptable to Shigi-sama, I don't think it'll be a bad thing. The three of them turn to stare at me. Of course I... No, I don't really, don't really feel like... Oh, yeah, of course I agree. Yeah... I do not to have any regrets, and I do not want Kohaku-san to worry about me. I am in favor, and I'm about to turn down my own welcome part, am I? It's decided. 
Well then, I will prepare the food. Isui chan, can you take care of my work for today? That'll be fine. Sweeping the lobby and the east building. Well then, I shall. What shall I do, Kohaku? I guess I'm a shiki son. Shall rest in their rooms. I'll prepare dinner early to, to make time for the party. So if you have anything you need to do, please try to be done by then, okay? Kohaku-san goes into the kitchen. He she goes into the goes into the courtyard. Well then, I'll go to my room. So, what should I do? I guess if I try to help Hisui, I'll just get in the way. Since I get actually home for a change, I guess I'll pass the time talking to her. Aika, you're here. Uh, Nissan, Nissan. <laughs> her sounds can be heard from within. I just wanted to talk for a bit. Is that okay? Uh, yes, please come in. I put my hand on the doorknob. Think about it. This is the first time I've ever been to Aiga's room. Were you never went when, when you were a kid? That's a bit weird. Hmm. I opened the door a bit tensely. Uh, I guess the room is exactly what I was. Uh, uh, words, words, words. I guess the room is exactly what I was expecting. What is it, Nissan? Is it something important to make you come to my room? I think I heard like a notification <laughs> going on in my tablet. Another room. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's not really a room. This office is not really a room, it's just connected to my bedroom. <laughs> no, no, I just felt like talking for a bit. If you're busy, I can come back later. Well, I am busy. I am busy. I can put, put that off to make time to talk with you. I got ties up the notebook on her desk. Oh, you, you were doing homework? I should go. I shouldn't interrupt your studies. No, I was just about to start, so I can le I can leave it for tonight. Wow, wow! I could leave it for later. Oh, sounds like someone similar, familiar. I'm talking about me, but you know. It's fine. So please sit down. I should make some tea. All right, but no tea, thanks. I wouldn't want to spoil my appetite today. Ah, uh, that's true then. I'll do the same. She looks disappointed. <laughs> Iga sits on a chair of her desk. I lower myself into a suitable chair and glance around Iga's room. There's a chair there, a chair there. There's a table there. Cause that's probably the entrance to her room. Then there's a sofa. Uh, it's like a bit bigger than 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 Shiki's room. I was about to say Shiro, but accent. <laughs> it's an amazing room, but of course, it's not really my type of place. I've even been able to sell in my own room. It's just the bed and desk. If they give me a room deck like like this, I might have fled. Hey, Aika. Yes? What is it? Um, you know something I've been wondering about for a while. Why, why do you call me back? The old man died, and while well, I am the eldest son, that doesn't seem like a much of a reason. What do you mean, not much of a reason? This is your home. It's only natural for you to come back here. That doesn't need to be a reason. There doesn't... Okay, that was her. There doesn't need to be a reason. Well, that's true, but don't you have a grudge against me? I left you here for eight years. Yes, of course I have a grudge. It was Father's fault. You were sent to live with Aramas, but it really made me mad that you didn't send a single letter during that time. Oh no, that was. That was what? Come on, Ni Nis Nisan, what is it? You come here, in here, to remind me of things I almost forgot. Do you enjoy making me angry that much? No, uh, of course, of course I didn't want to make you angry. 
The thing about the letter, I didn't do it because the old man for maybe to do it, so... I know that. I'm angry because you brought it up. Ah, I'm sorry. I wondered. I wonder I shouldn't have mentioned it. Indeed. Please don't talk about such traveling matters. With a sound of noise, Aika looks away. Wait, what am I doing? There are took the turtle to come to talk to Aika. Why am I talking about such important things? Well, I guess it's like it's like you to carry such small facts forever. Kohaku said it's so too, right? This is your home. You should be more relaxed. Yeah, I think I'll get used to it gradually. But... But what? Well, no, it's, it's just... There's no nostalgia. I don't really like an imagine, but I'm confused more than none of it matches my memories. Well, I guess I've been away for eight years, so it's natural? Hmm. What's with that expression? Like I said, I don't have anything against the mansion. Don't worry. I don't want to leave or anything. Uh, yeah, I'm glad, but... I looked away for some reason. Nason. Nice. Nason. Wait, Nason. Yes, Nason. I have a question I forgot to ask, too. It's about the injury from your axe eight years ago. Hmm. Injury from the accident? You mean the wound in my chest? Yes. Kaka said it hasn't been completely healed yet, but does it still trouble you? Hmm, I don't know. The actual wound itself healed ages ago, but there's some unstable organs that got damaged. I heard that some of the wounds will heal in time, but some will stay unstable. I guess it's my un insensed insens amenia is the result of that, in addition to the some emotional damage from the accident. Does it, um, hurt Nissan? Nissan? Yeah, now I should say Nissan, because I don't freaking know. I can remember that question, looking, look, looking away. Nah, it doesn't hurt anymore. I just feel a little diz dizzy when I wake up. No worse than that. Well, perhaps it hurts occasionally, in the dead of winter. The distance has faded lately, and I'm sure that Amina will go away in a few years. Anyways, nothing to worry about. There are people out there with wounds that won't recover from for from twenty years. So my wounds nothing in comparison. I gotta say he's nothing. Still looking away. Damn, the atmosphere has become heavy again. I guess completely motionless. Somehow it seems unnatural. Hey, Aiga. Uh, Nissan. Aika looks up. She lacks all vitality as if she was passed out until now. What's wrong? Do you feel bad? Do you, you should lie down. I'll go back to my room. No, no, that's not it. I was just listening to you. I was remembering about the past. Aika by shakes. She almost falls off her chair, but she remains in, in, in it somehow. She takes a halting breath. Hmm, that's a different picture I've never seen before. So we'll probably see more of her, more of those, I don't know, images? I have no idea what you call that in visual novels. I have no idea. Because I know what, what those graphics are called. They're called CGs, but but that's it. <laughs> and I know the, the sex scenes are called H scenes. That's it. These images, I have no idea what they're called. <laughs> Aga, you're really acting strangely. You should lie down. No, it's alright. It's not as bad as yours, but I get dizzy too. I was just thinking about the accident eight years ago. Your wound was so deep that there was so much blood out of it. That's why I felt so bad. I see. If that's so, but... If that's so, but don't push yourself. If you're bad, please tell me. Of course. I would do that without being I'll do it without being told. It's alright, unlike yours, my days is is purely mental. I got answered me clearly, completely recovered. 
It's almost time, isn't it? Kohaku will call us soon, so you should go back to your room. Ah, five o'clock already. Well, I'll go back to my room. Like, don't push yourself. It doesn't any good not to speak of when you're, you're suffering. Uh oh It's not like you to be so concerned about me, niece, son. Maybe I should... should maybe I should do once in a while. Dummy. Is just an Dummy, it's just an occasional thing. I'll see you later. I open the door. Our room is at the very end of the west wing. A good 50 meters from my room at the end of the east wing. Nason. Uh, Nason. Yeah, I just keep. No, I, I have no idea what to say, Nason. 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 Yeah, I think Nason's a spare for. What is it? Did you forget something? No, it's not that, but. I got false sign, unable to find the right words. With eyes glancing at me. I'm sorry. It's... It's nothing. Seems like they're apologizing to me. I see. I'll see you in the dining room later. I won't get angry whatever you do today. So don't worry. Oh, that's a relief. The Kahaku Hanako has a feast. I was hoping we might be able to forget about the table matters today. Thought I leave Aika's room. Oh, I shouldn't snap back. Interesting. Well then, then the Tosa Shiki san's homecoming. Everyone, please take whatever you like. Like to drink. The Haka lines up drinks and froze. With full smile, entirely free of malice. Entirely free of malice. Most of the drinks didn't happen to be juice or anything like that. But proper alcoholic beverages. Beverages. Uh, Aika. Hmm? What is it, Nason? Nissan. Yeah, yeah, easy. There, there's a girl. There's a gurgling as Aiko fills her glass with twenty liquid, then adds a little orange juice. A little, and adds a little orange juice. Uh, that that won't be whiskey, wouldn't it? It would. Is there something wrong? It would. I, Aiko. Um, are we all too young to be drinking? This is your welcome, welcoming party. We have have alcohol, don't we? <laughs> that is like a, such a in alcohol, such an interesting or rebellious face of Aiko. Oh, Nissan, you're too weak when it comes to alcohol. Aiko seems somehow delighted. Ah, uh, Hisui chan, as I need you not juice today. Seeing a little shy, he slightly pours wine into her glass. See, see, nice, nice, son. Even his is drinking. Surely you won't, don't intend to be the only one drinking juice. Jeez, you really want me get the most out of this part, don't you, Aika? Yes, I don't usually like parties, but today is an exception. Huh? Well, it can't be helped. A lot of alcohol isn't good for my body, but a little should be okay. The weakest drink laid out of the table is wine, it looks like. Well then, everyone raise your glasses, please. Cheers! Of a clash of our glasses come together. Kahaku tosses hers down in a single gulp. I got takes her time, and he really slips hers quietly. Oh, I'd like to see that. Oh man, I'm not... I'm not responsible for this. Oh, there is something. Okay, there, mister. Okay. And in less than an hour, Hisui falls asleep and Kohaku carries her to her room with a smile. Not being used to alcohol, my mind is a little fuzzy. I guess it's... Nearby and still drinking eagerly, e eagerly, eagerly. It doesn't bond, bode well for the rest of the evening. I you really have, you really have some lyrian, lyrians, don't you? Oh, there, you can see you're drinking. You can see the, the classic whiskey 
mm, ice thing. Oh, I'm not drinking. It's straight up, so I think it's about normal. Um, that's on the point. I'm saying she's pretty used to drinking for being a minor. She's making that face again. Please get at least a little drunk, Nissan. Nissan, Nissan, whatever. Kohaku, prepare all this to. Kohaku, prepare all this to cheer up. So it isn't meaningless if you don't. Ah, uh, that's right. Yeah, I have to drink Kohaku san for her consideration. Thanks, so I do feel a bit better. What are you saying? You don't look happy at all. If alcohol doesn't make you feel better, isn't there nothing? If isn't there nothing left? Wow, that's a little bold. Saying nothing is left if alcohol doesn't work. Isn't that mistaken? It cannot be helped if you do not wish to speak to me, Nissan. Yeah, I said Nissan. If you will, you, if, what did you talk about last night? If you would talk about last night, I want ask to, for the help of alcohol. Oh wow, she's trying to get us drunk <laughs> so, we, so we can blur out those that nonsense. I see. Just like Kohaku-san, Kahaika is concerned about me. But I can ask, right? I'm very, I already promise no longer to ask about it. Sorry, I'm just a, bit, a big burden to everyone. Oh, and sorry, I'm, I'm just a big burn to everyone. Okay, that was shiki. Well, as long as you understand, it's all right. Um, as you as you say, I seem. Um, as you say, I seem to be a little drunk, so I'll go outside. She stays drunk, but her steps are firm as she exits the dining room. Following Aiga, I go out to the courtyard to get some fresh air. It's still before six o'clock the red sun paints the sky still the afternoon so the afternoon there's no one else around i thought Iga was going to be here but i guess i'm we missed each other red sunset until now the, the red sun that reminded me of fresh blood today it reminded me of her final smile as we parted on the road home a stunning pain in my chest does the scar of my of my chest hurts, or is my heart in pain from regret? Or I can't tell the difference. Only that my chest hurts, as if it was bleeding. Gah! This is assails me, because of the alcohol and the pain in my chest. Such a small, insignificant thing caused me to lose consciousness. My house is this way. My house is this way. Seeing that she went down a different path. I'm surprised I still remember her voice. Thanks. She's pro she, she probably said that since I was there for her until the very end. Sorry. She, she probably said that since she knew I will carry this regret from now on. So it was okay to forget. I felt like she whispered those words in my ears. Isn't that just a false happiness? In a dream, I dream about, I dream such selfish words. If I can just forget, it'll be very easy for me. But I can't forget. I didn't like her, nor did I hear her. But I think I should have forget her smile. And more than that, as long as this scar remains on my neck, I can't forget. Ah, when I come to, I'm lying in my room. When I was sleeping, Aika must have been watching me because she's there in front of me. Aika? Have you awakened? Goodness, Sunny claps like that. What happened, Nissan? I see. Did I pass out? Yes. Thankfully, you woke up quickly. I'm sorry for forcing you to drink like that. No, that's nothing to do with this. I just collapse on, on my own. Saying that, I stare at the ceiling. My head is still dizzy, and I don't, and I don't feel like talking to Aika right now. Even so, Aika is not bothered by this, 
She quietly tends to me. Like. Yes. What is it, Nissan? I'm well. Isn't it boring for you? I'm fine, so you can go back to your room if you want. Are you saying I'm bothering you? No, that's not it at all. I was just thinking about that maybe you were a little bored. It is boring, but I can stand it. This is this this is something I'm doing out of my own interest. So there's no need for you to worry, Nissan. Then I guess that's alright. Time passes. It's past seven o'clock. Seven hours since then. Has Aga been tending me this long? Aga suddenly takes my temperature. Ah, I remember now. Well, this seems a bit different than the tea ceremony room. Very different. I remember now. That had to, that had to have been more than eight years ago. Aga came to watch over me after I caught a cold or something like that. It really was a terrible cold. Even breathing was painful. A black-haired girl sat by my pillow, holding my hand and just staring at me. Tatami and So and Shoji, the cold winter air, and the dark Tatami mat room. The young figure of Aiga watched me on the verge of tears. Why is he in the Tatami room? I know why, but I'm not gonna say why. Well, I'm just saying, you know, just to make it interesting. I'm a little relieved. Eh? Did you see some in Nissan? Uh, yeah. I was just thinking about there was a little bit of old Aiga on you. It's not really anything, but it makes me pretty happy. I got Aiga Jen as well, so naturally it's almost surprises me. Mm, that is fine, but you haven't changed at all, Nissan. Causing so much work for others, please act more properly. Aiga looks away and complains. Understandingly, She's just embarrassed. I start to feel more happier. <laughs> shh, 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 shh. Why are you smiling like that? If you have, have this much energy, I guess you don't need me to take care of you. No, that's not it. I just remembered something from a long time ago. Ah, uh, can that the Tommy room? The Tommy room? What is this all about? I said I was taking care of me, but why wasn't the time room, not my room? Something. There's something not quite right. Aika. Is there a room with the Tommy in this mansion? No. There's no Japanese rooms in this mansion. Yeah, you're right. There's nothing. I thought it was odd. Don't worry about it. Hmm. What is so odd about not having a Japanese room? Oh, you know. This mansion is so big, I thought there would maybe, maybe just at least one. There is a detached Japanese style building, however. Eh? Now she mentions, of course. In the middle of the forest and the garden, there was a Japanese style, man style mansion. Goodness, you really have become more energetic. I keep. I don't know how to pronounce that word pro properly. For some reason, I have no freak clue. I think I will be only being away if I stay longer, so I'll return to my room. Standing up, furniture Aiga goes to leave the room. Thanks, Aiga. Sorry for making you stay here this whole time. Please don't mind. Starting tomorrow, your daily life will become more like this. After saying something like that, I don't quite understand, Aiga exits the room. I turn off the lights and rest my bed. Thanks to Aiga taking care of me, I feel more relaxed. At this rate, I shall be able to dream peacefully for the first time in days. I take a deep breath and slowly close my eyes. Right before I fall asleep, the memory of myself being tended by young Aiga further surf surfaced in my mind. A dark diving side room where no one came to see me. Did she sneak away from Mikasa? Aiga snuck in and cried as she held my hand. I'm s I'm sorry, she was saying. I didn't know why, but the black-haired girl kept repeating, I'm sorry, over and over. I remember, 
but the proud eldest daughter of the Tolan family was only one one to care for me. The young girl always crying in dark Japanese room. I bit my tongue in frustration while being dizzy from fever. I wonder why she goes crying. If it was me, I would never, never let I go cry. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Shiki, Nissan. Her tears were simply beautiful. Since that time, I vowed to be a real brother. Huh? And here, remember, he's adopted. <laughs> okay, I'll stop here. That's pretty short, so. Uh, I'm probably not as short as like. Uh, I don't. I'm not gonna add the mints. <laughs> I'll see you later. Oh my god, damage out. Bye!